Hey there, how is everyone doing? I am DCSK and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be sharing with you guys on what is Harry Query, how to upgrade it, and how to use its bonus in the fight against Sanctuary Pickers Threat. Okay, if you are new to the game, you unlock Harry Query by finishing the main quest in Balfon and then reunite with Deckard Kane. Speak to his companion, Rayyard and Chelsea to begin the short quest that unlock the Harry Query for use. And you will be fighting the very first single player boss, Chaos Herald Pile at the end of Challenge Rift Level 2. After defeated him, he will drop you Pile Flowing Chaos, pick it up, then go back and speak to Rayet. Deal the item into Harry Query to gain bonus and special attribute from the item. The Harry Query is a special device that allows you to locate and defeat powerful demons in a massive Eggman raid encounter. It is impossible to solo a Hercury boss regardless of your combat rating as the game will require an 8-man raid group to attempt a raid. Form a group with other players, either by creating or joining a raid, or team up with your warband members to go against the Hercury boss. The bosses are very difficult to kill on top of their BFP HP pool. These bosses also have special attacks that can one-shoot players depending on their build. It is better to learn the attack pattern of the encounter, especially when the difficulty starts to ramp up at higher level. After defeating the demon for the first time, you will be given its demonic remains which can be stored in the Harry Query for different in-game bonuses. Harry Query offer a permanent combat rating buff as you level up. Additional bonus can also be had via demonic remains but they only be active in Challenge Rift. And you can switch your trophy from time to time to get bonus a trip that suits your play style. But only one of them can be active at a time. So far, there are only three demonic remains. The first one is Pile Flowing Chaos. Drop by Chaos Herald Pile, the very first single player boss. Second one is Flame Twisted Claw. Drop by Lasso the Flame Spawn. The third one is Frozen Wing of the Shivering Death. Drop by Vita the Shivering Death and more bosses will be added soon. Each Harry Query boss encounter will indicate its required combat rating when you open the red windows. You won't be able to create or join a red group if you don't meet the required combat rating. Although it is possible to join a red group with a requirement higher than your combat rating through an invitation from a fellow clan member who meets the requirement and is currently in a red group. So to upgrade your Harry Query, you need to defeat Harry Query bosses. It rewards special material called Scoria which you can bring to Chasi the Blacksmith to refine into Hellfire Scoria for a small gold fee. Once you have enough Hellfire Scoria, go to the Harry Query screen from the menu and upgrade it. Upgrading your Harry Query gives a boost to your combat rating and at certain level unlocks slot for sealing demonic remains. To get more Scoria, you need to defeat Harry Query bosses. You can defeat as many times as you want but only reward you twice on every week. It will reset on every Monday and Thursday so make sure to defeat it at least once to get the reward before reset. Completing a Harry Query raid weekly with your warband also give all members an eternal legendary crest voucher which allow them to purchase an eternal legendary crest from the crest merchant for 1600 platinum. The Crest Merchant is located at south of Elder Rift entrance. Okay guys, that's all about Helicory. I hope you enjoyed the video and get to learn something useful. And don't forget to give a like to the video and subscribe to my channel. Any question or suggestion, you can leave a comment below or hit me at my Discord community. Everyone is welcome to join. And last, thanks for watching. Happy grinding and I'm gonna see you in the next video. Yeah.